Hello citizens of Pride Imagination of Hannibal, welcome to the frontier who playing Europa Nisales 4 Extended Mentally Experienced Mod. A bit of a battle going on here. A bit of a war going on here, actually. I'm gonna have to take another loan. Yeah. Why are we not using war taxes? Let's just raise war taxes. Should have raised war taxes long ago. What the hell? Okay, Poland, get out of here. No, bad Poland. Yeah, you you stay out there. You stay out of that. Yeah, you go. You go fight someone else or something. I can force march. I don't want to get caught. Actually, is this going to cross the river? It is going to cross the river. Their general, though, is... He, the Moldavia rolled for a 0-6. No, I'm not fighting that. I'm not crossing there in four days, unfortunately. You can move around like this. Yeah, you get out of there. Just just leave, okay? More British. British have a lot of men. Hm. Let's go back to Emden and meet them. Literally. It'll turn them into meat. And we are running low in manpower now, which is not good. I'd like this war to be over, actually, now. Our army is under attack. Of course, they have no chance, because they, they have landing penalties, and they have leader penalties, which is not having a leader. Kind of sucks <laughs> when you don't have a leader. Actually, we could uh, stick with this fleet. How can I... There we go. Attach to always follow Escadre Blanche. Blow it up! If we rid England of their fleet, it's going to be absolutely glorious. Come on. We have sheer numbers advantage. Should be fine. Go help out Bohemia. Because France can hold their own. It's just Bohemia that needs helping. <coughs> Our artist has died, and we only have level 2 advisors. Abs just great. Great stuff. Oh, we can switch him out for this dude. Yes, yeah, sure. Let's do that. Eh, we could go for a build cost guy or missionary strength. We'll see. Missionary strength would be rather nice, actually, to have. It's a very long naval battle there. Uh-oh. Quickly, get over there! Ah, oh, damn it. We didn't make it in time. And I don't know where Poland is. So I should be careful, actually, and not doing, not do that. I'm gonna go back to, to Hamburg. God damn, it's a long naval battle. La Regent. They have better positioning and better morale, but we have numbers, and they don't. And they're losing ships, finally. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, they're losing ships at last. Call back a dude from Alsace. Anjbach is going to receive a diplomat now. Come on, blow them up. Destroy their ships. They're losing ground. There's the Polish armies. I called it. <laughs> called it! Hmm. <laughs> 
Royal Diplomat from Holland. Holland loves us now. Next on the list is uh, Augsburg. Let's send the Diplomat to them. This naval battle. Very interesting. Yeah, 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 yeah! Kill the Red Lion! So, we captured one ship? We lost one ship. We lost one trader ship, and uh, the French captured one ship. Okay. Detach from following Escarpe Blanche. Nah, keep him. Keep him. Keep him around. Send some men to Bomewald. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Technology cost goes down. Now we get also 10% production efficiency. Our ships cost less and we build them faster. Amazing. Absolutely great. Blow up the Flander Flemish fleet. Good. Killed it. Killed it outright. And now we can also repair while in the coastal sea zones. So we can detach actually now and send these ships to keep protecting trade in Lübeck. There we go. And they'll repair. They will reap air. Our ships also cost less, which is nice. And we can have a lot more of them. So we will have a lot more of them. Could also have another dude, but I'm not going to build another dude just yet. Let's go get this guy. Repairing in coastal sea zones is amazing. By the way. Yeah. Yeah. Now let's see, which points are we getting the most? We're getting most of the military points. And we're about to... Aha, uh -huh. so 304. Seize Churchland. So we could seize Churchland to get money. Aha. Uh -huh. I see. No, I think we will donate land to the church. Church estates with one. Hmm. Enlist privateers. Yeah, sure, why not? I think it's good. I think it's a good thing. You can enlist privateers and get um, embargo efficiency plus 10. Better relations over time, I understand, sucks, but... More money. More money for us. This battle is over. When the battle's over, turn of the light. When the battle's over, seize Churchland. Let's uh, disable that. I don't want it. I'd rather have monthly fervor than lose it. Seems that like also our bonus has been turned off. That's unfortunate. Ah, good. We can convert some provinces. Rather nice. Rather. Yeah, I'll send, I'll send my men, like, in their capital. Keep them around. Ah, yeah, sure, whatever. So, what idea group do we need right now? Economic or religious? Maybe. Innovative, maybe. Defensive, I want for sure. At some point, I really want it. <clears throat> Naval, maybe, as well. Who knows? Maybe I want naval. Oh, they have maritime. Though, so... 
<laughs> yeah, I think maritime is all I need in terms of naval ideas. So I think it's gonna be either defensive or mercantilist. Or like economy, e economic ideas maybe. Economic ideas actually may be something I want to go for right now. In fact, why don't we just take them? Looking through them, it's taxed quite nicely with what we already have. Let's take them. We're going economic. Economic also has some really nice events, so I'm gonna stick to, to that choice. And we have another decision available. Adopt an heir, donate state land to the church. Let us pass. Let's donate. Let's donate state land to the church. Yeah. Yeah. I'm good with that. We can donate. Do we want to cross and fight these guys? It's not that we have some amazing advantages or anything like that. I think if status quo persists and we get Bumbald back, which means we get taking war score on our side, we will not really win the war, but we won't lose it. France is dealing with their war now. Just... Just fine. <laughs> Pretty much. Um, more ships, yes, of course. I'm, I'm always up for more ships. A bit low on trade, but that's fine. Well, not really a bit low on trade, but we're getting less from trade income. No, no, never mind. We're getting, we're getting just fine now. Nineteen point three, something like that. Though so something like that we used to get before as well. What's this guy called? Chancellor. Hm. Lots of new, interesting um, advisors, which I really like. Really, really like. Me likey, me likey. 28% in this siege. Good. Aha, so he's going to attack me. That's actually pretty good for me, I think, maybe. Yeah, he's got the river crossing. And if Bohemia does actually help me out in this battle, which it hopefully does. Could adopt an heir. Just for 10 legitimacy and 15 prestige? Unable to provide the state with the heir, we can adopt a distant member. Let's try this. A legitimacy of our adopted heir's claim. So we probably will have... So I figure what happens is we get a low legitimacy, like low claim strength heir. Which is not superb. I'm gonna try it. Ah, yeah. Yeah, but we get a weak claim. But this guy's pretty good. 355. Five. Let's get him. The orc. butchley has got a weak claim. That's, a, that's fine, though. Let's educate him. So, he's obviously lacking an admin, so let's educate him with our steward. Okay. We are winning this battle, which is good. Planning for the future. 
So we have we have the Duke's dearest wife, so that she is Diplo and Dadmin, but less military. Prominent general is probably more jet more military. But less Diplo. Duke's brother. Probably like <clears throat> this is probably like admin military. This is like Diplo military. This must be I don't know actually. I don't know what these two are. Let's try a prominent clergyman this time around. Let's see what happens. If we get a Med Regency Council, that is. This battle's going to be a victory. Good. Well, at least it looks like. Seems that way. Ooh, yes. Mercantilism is right. Mercantilism is so very right. You can adopt the military tech. Good. We get new cannons. Large cast iron cannons. Better at firing. Let's go siege Bommelwald. Or actually, let's go free... Let's, let's go siege Vienna. Screw that shit. We're going for Vienna itself. You're going to protect trade in Lübeck. Same goes for you. Good stuff. Good stuff. I like this so far. Good stuff has been happening. Ah, oh, no way. Sweden, no! Sweden is going to full annex Denmark. God darn it. Don't do that to me, Sweden. Don't do me dirty like this. Control Estonia. Ah, scheiße. Yeah, well, at least he annexed Denmark. So that's something. Please don't tell me he's going to be contesting trade now. Well, he's got trade power here, but... Uh, hopefully he's not going to do anything with it. Yet. Ah, uh, well. Whatever. It's fine either way. It sucks that we didn't get the points improval. But I guess you have to... Ah, there we go. White piece. I guess you have to... What? Bohemia, give me access. I don't have diplomats. Request for access. Give me access to. There. Yeah. Send some troops. Send my troops back home. I don't know why did I why didn't they get exiled? Weird. But yeah, where was I? Talking something about airs. Oh yes, we were talking about how we didn't get to. Um, how did how did we get? Didn't we get the the education thingy? I guess you have to live until the. Like you, you don't, you cannot get regency councils. Probably is the thing here. Probably is, what it is. What uh, was this guy doing? He's a, he was in Ansbach, right? Yeah, he was in Ansbach. Send him back. Renew war taxes? No, I don't think so. <laughs> now we're paying loads for army maintenance. Uh, yeah, we can't expect to have peak efficiency. We're gonna lose a lot of money in reinforcement, but that's fine. That's just all right. Provincial unrest in Braunschweig. Yeah, let's. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> we have war exhaustion, apparently. That's not cool. Being at war sucks. Come on, France. You can stop it. Let's get this over with. We're done. France is losing a naval battle here. That's not nice. Definitely not nice. Oh, <laughs> look at that. We have just enough men. To reinforce. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Barely enough men to reinforce. That's a good war, then. Can build some buildings. Yeah, these, Im these bronzes are just absolutely not improved. Which is terrible, by the way. You should improve your bronzes more, peoples. Eh, yeah, well, I guess they can keep Shelland for now. Yeah, Denmark doesn't exist anymore, so we can safely convert these when we convert the religions. They have nationalism still, which is going to last for quite a while, but that's okay. We're actually making quite a bit of admin points. Maybe we should take some kind of administrative idea group. Oh, yep. <laughs> Never mind, we already did. Yeah, I thought we didn't. Rivalry against Poland, whatever. But I think it's time to put a cut in between episodes here. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you again next time.